So this is our Mazda MX-5 Venture Edition. In extremely good condition. We've had the uh, wheels refurbished. One owner of the owner from you. It's got a full service history. Low mileage and the paintwork. It's just been uh, polished. As you can tell the paintwork is in excellent condition. All round. And the colour is uh, it's quite it's got a bit of a sparkle to it, say a bit. It's got quite a bit of a sparkle to it. Bit of a uh, purpley maroon colour. around the outside inside boot and engine bay I then put the hard top back, hard top back on sorry and then take it for a test drive and show you uh, what it's like out on the road so like I've said all the wheels have been refurbished to a, uh, a gunmetal grey and that's an all four obviously door mirrors are all good Paint works in an excellent condition, like I've said, and it contrasts well with the uh, full leather sort of brown interior. There's no dents on the paintwork at all. As you can see in the reflection, all around this car is just a lovely example. Great sports car. Coming around to the back, I'll show you the wheels first of all. Same again. Wheels are all good. So is the paintwork. Offside rear wheel. are all good door mirrors as well windscreen if I now show you the uh, boot uh, press the button here oh hang on there we go Now as we go into the interior, we've got like um, brown leather seats, and these are heated by the way, both sides obviously, and you've then got black, piano black trims around the inside as well, so you've got around the back of the headrests, we go inside, if I zoom out a bit, you've got piano black dashboard, follows through to the uh, centre, leather steering wheel, grey stitching, There you go, 12,523. Piano black steering wheel controls or the outer trim, I should say. Leather seats are all in excellent condition. I mean, you can tell how well this car has been kept just by uh, looking at it. I'm sure you guys can tell. Hard to see, but you've got a sat nav on the infotainment system. I believe this comes, this uh, sat, um, this display is from factory and it comes with the Venature Special Edition because I, I believe they have the Bose Stereo as standard and this is the upgrade. So you've got a sat nav. Uh, if we go on to, if I can figure out how this thing works, there we go. 
Now, the lights aren't flickering in real life, it's just down to the recording. There's the, all the controls. Brown leather here, brown trimming here. Seats are all good. Now, if I jump in and close it, if I pop the bonnet first of all, I'll show you the bonnet in a sec. Now I'm going to put the roof up. So to do that, press the, you've got the close and open here. To press the close, if I zoom in, there go. If I press the close, at the back and the only thing I've got to do is push this zoom in push this forward and put the windows up and then it's been converted to a hard top and to open this you just simply press release and then that's it and, and that's now that's locked so when I close the windows nice and fast and so is the um electronic roof operation that's now the hard top now on same again paint works all good all around the whole car and if I just show you the uh, engine then we'll take it for a drive there we go. Right. So this Mazda MX-5 has a 2 litre petrol engine and a 6 speed manual gearbox in 5th gear going into 6th, gear changes feel excellent and the clutch feels good and the brakes are nice and sharp which is what we like, pulls away nicely even in 6th gear, this engine's obviously naturally aspirated, MX-5s are well known for being or having naturally aspirated engines which is what you want really, a small sports car. Nice and whizzy and fun around the bends. Right. Third gear, going to fourth gear. Fifth gear. Sixth gear, lovely. It's a lot of fun at the bends. Nice and playful, and it looks good as well. I love the colour, the colour of this car is just lovely. Most of the time I think MX-5s from this, uh, I believe this is the ND, do, get, do sometimes lose track of the numbers and letters of cars and models and stuff. But this one is most popular with grey I think, I don't know why. And the grey looks nice, but I think this is quite an unusual colour for this car and it's got a nice spec in it being the Adventure Special or Ice Special, whatever you call it fifth gear nice and low spun at the corners makes it seem a lot more fun driving this car there we go There we go, brakes are all good. If I brake without touching the steering wheel, that way you guys can see there's no pulling from the steering wheel under uh, braking. I'll do it in a second. Here we go. There we go, back into first. It's got one owner from you, 
less than what 13,000 miles. It's going to drive like new, really. It's been well taken care of. I forgot to mention actually, this car's also got Bill Stein shocks. I forgot to mention that in the walk around, so I'm glad I realised that now. So yeah, the suspension's all good. It's not harsh at all. You might think it's got Bill Steiner suspension. It's not hard at all. It's more fun at the corners with the uh, better suspension setup, but it's not crashy or thumpy. It's it just evens out nicely. This is a car you can enjoy just cruising at 30 miles an hour in fifth gear, and you can also enjoy in second gear, again, at 40 miles an hour or 50. And, you know, it's obviously good on the motorway as well, or the A-roads, I'm not on the A-road right now, but it's, it's a good car, very good car. So yeah, um, that's it really. I think I've covered everything. I do hope this video um, helps some of you who are looking at buying this or looking at viewing this. You're more than welcome to view this in person, book a test drive. Please do give us a call on 01277 563 561 so we can get the car ready for you if you do want to collect it or drive away or test drive it at all. Um, we're based in Essex and Hutton, cm 13 Monty j is our postcode. So yeah, I hope you uh, enjoyed this. And uh, thank you for watching and we hope to see you soon. Thank you.